Researchers at Pitt say they have found untapped lithium in Pennsylvania and lots of it. In fact, their new study suggests that nearly half of the lithium used in the U.S. could come from the Keystone State. I spoke with one of the researchers tonight about how they made this discovery and what happens next. Researchers at the University of Pittsburgh found an enormous gold mine of lithium in Pennsylvania. It's been right under our noses this whole time in the wastewater from Marcellus shale gas wells. This is lithium concentrations that already exist at the surface in some capacity in Pennsylvania. And we found that um, the lithium, um, there was sufficient lithium in the waters uh, to supply somewhere between, you know, 30 and 40 percent of the current U.S. national demand. Research scientist and Ph.D. student Justin Mackey and his mentor Dan Bain, associate professor of Pitt's geology and environmental sciences, spent years analyzing Pennsylvania Department of Environmental Protection compliance data and published their findings in the journal Scientific Reports. In this map they created, the darker the shade, the more lithium concentration in waste that's already being handled. If you can extract value added materials and specifically lithium from this, um, then you reduce the cost of remediating and handling this waste. They haven't even looked at wastewater in neighboring states like Ohio and West Virginia. So that number could be um, could be a lot larger. So there's an economic uh, boon for the region as well. It's essential for the production of technology we use every day, like smartphones and laptops, but it comes from across the globe. The USGS lists lithium as a critical mineral. That designation means the U.S. government wants all lithium to be produced domestically by 2030. There are lithium mining operations in the U.S., but Mackey says this is different. The attractive nature of this type of resource, it being water, is that um, you can start to apply um, some newer technologies like direct lithium extraction methods where you're just focusing on the lithium and keeping everything else in solution. While fracking can be a controversial topic, Mackey says they're already expanding their analysis to other produced waters and looking at the environmental impact of extracting lithium. I do hope that um, it sheds light on um, creative uh, remediation and reuse of, of these fluids. There's a lot of materials that are embodied in the water. 